Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. On this episode I'm going to introduce to you a famous mosque in my hometown known as Agabazurk, located on Fazal Naragi street. This place dates back to 200 years ago when Ghajar dynasty was ruling over Iran. Its patron was a philanthropist man known as Muhammad Taqi Khanban who allocated his money to building this mosque and the building process took 10 years. To be precise, building procedure began in 1834 and was completed in 1844 according to the tablet above the main entrance. This place was designated for praying and teaching religious lessons at that time. But nowadays, it is a magnificent tourist attraction in Kashan city. Historians believe that this place was built on the remnants of a devastated building in the past when a catastrophic earthquake happened in 1778. By passing time, this structure went through many changes in its form, especially its wooden doors have been changed when were damaged by termites. In Persian language, Aga means Sir and Buzurg means Eminent. So Aga Buzurg was a title that people gave to an Ayatollah known as Muhammad Mehdi Naragi in Kashan. When Muhammad Shah Gajar traveled to Kashan, he met him and realized that this ayatollah was so knowledgeable. So he decreed to build a mosque named after Naragi's title. This mosque was built in a way to have two floors. The underground floor was used as a religious school dormitory. It has four flower beds and a pool to double down the beauty of this part. Also pool and trees have a pivotal role in making the environment cooler during the summer season. Having a lower floor in the structure made the water flow more easily because at that time people used channels to access the water of aqueduct. This mosque has a colossal dome that is based on eight pillars. Dome is perforated to create a natural air circulation in the hot season and works as a skylight as well. There are two minarets with beautiful tiles. In the past, these minarets were designated as a place to declare Azan which is a religious proclamation for people to know when they should come to the mosque and pray. Some people believe that the dome is a symbol for human's head and minarets are a symbol for hands. And the whole structure represents a person who is raising his hands toward the sky and praying. In every aspect this place is symmetric. Symmetrical design makes the whole structure more durable against pressure and doubles down the aesthetic aspect of this building. There are some unique patterns on the walls made out of plaster and in geometrical designs to show Iranian architecture extraordinaire. This place has many colorful tiles arranged in geometrical designs and painted by eminent artists with miscellaneous themes but most of them show birds, flowers and other tiles with paisley patterns. There are abundant motifs on the walls that all of which are Quran verses in calligraphy art.
This structure has a hefty wooden door to protect this place from intruders. Doors have many nails in them. Some historians believe that the number of these nails equal the number of Quran verses. Another door that has geometrical motifs was designed in a way to pass the air and create a natural air circulation. This feature was so advantageous in the past and made the inside of the room cooler. Wind towers are responsible for catching the wind, trapping it and guiding it through narrow channels toward the basement. Basement is built out of special materials to maintain moisture in them in order to make the air circulation cooler. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Let me know your opinion in the comment section and if you like please subscribe to my channel and wait for new videos.